Hello everyone, my name is Gani. So today we're going to talk about productivity and the tool that I use to manage my tasks and manage my productivity for the day is called Todoist. And I've been using this tool for a long time now. And in fact, if I look at my karma rating right now, it shows that I'm a grandmaster. Not too bad. So I've been using this tool for a long time. However, I cannot seem to manage my productivity well. Okay. Uh, th there's nothing wrong with the tool. It's just the metho methodology around productivity. So I've tried a lot, including GTD and all that, but it just doesn't seem to work. And over the years, by using Todoist, I've been trying to improve the method of how I can manage my tasks better. And I think I found it. So I'm about to share with you guys today. And let's get straight into it. So number one, uh, the inbox, right? So the inbox where you literally dump all the tasks that you have in your head into here. So for instance, I need to record this video, productivity video, right? Productivity. Into the list in the inbox. So in the next step, what you need to do is you've got to arrange uh, when you're going to do it. So in to do is every single thing has only one date, which is like uh, the due date, right? So I intend to do it today. Now, the problem is this is that I notice is task can vary from five minutes, 10 minutes to up to a few days. So when you have variable of tasks, you can't just say today, I'm going to finish it because it takes a few days to edit and record and publish. So it didn't make sense to me back then. So this was the one, one of the issues why all my tasks get postponed, and rescheduled every day and doesn't seem to work. Uh, so the solution that I found was, the first thing is dump everything that you have in your head into the inbox. Now, this is where labels comes in. Now, I have four labels, but a majority of it, I will use only three, which is morning, evening and night. So if you get the idea is, what I'm trying to do is each task will have a set of time that you need to accomplish it, right? So you know that recording this video, for instance, it's going to take me probably an hour or two just to record this video. And you only have finite hours in the day, right? Uh, you only have like eight working hours or maybe 10 at max before you need to go to bed. And in between that, you have meetings, you have call, you need to be in places, you need to answer the email, you need to work on a document. So even minusing all that, including lunch hour, break hours and so on, you only have few hours left. So it doesn't make sense for you to have a long list of tasks you need to accomplish for the day when you only have a few hours to accomplish that specific task that you have. So what I do is uh, when I go into the tasks here, I used to have... Um, labels that I do or I'll just put it here two hours that I know I, I'm going to take two hours to accomplish this so I just edit two hours here click save and done so and I will then segregate for instance let's say it's going to take me eight hours to do this example to edit the video and it's going to take me 30 minutes to publish this How do you even spell minutes? Yep, right. So, and I've done this, right? So, and I'm going to edit this video today, but it's not to say that this is the due date. I'm going to publish this video probably tomorrow. Okay, right. So now I've completed the due dates, meaning that uh, the time that I intend to do this, not intend to deliver this particular task. So the next thing I need to do is create the labels. Now, uh, in Todoist, labels are premium. So you need to subscribe. And I'm telling you, it's worth the money. Please subscribe to Todoist. It's, 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 a, it's a great tool. So I have morning, evening, and night. So what happens here is if I go into my Today tab, I have all the list here. So now, to, uh, in let me, let me try to explain the concept of labels here. So labels are what you identify... Um, in terms of where does this particular task belongs to. It used to be in GTD that labels are, for instance, call, emails, 
uh, tools or location that you would attach this particular task to but i don't think that's effective for me so i have split it to morning evening and night meaning that i will allocate each of the tasks depends on the duration when i would like to do the task whether in the morning in the evening or in the night so basically and i know in the morning i only have a set of hours so for instance right uh let's say in the morning i only have about three hours before i have have another meeting or lunch hour so i only will schedule a task within that three hours now if you can see the recording the productivity video is two hours so i could schedule this in the sorry in the morning all right and i'll click x so i know that this is going to take about two hours and only have about three hours in the morning so i'll just work on this uh, according to my experience right now uh, i can only accomplish three to four tasks a day on average taking account to everything else so i'm just going to keep it one task for the morning and uh, to edit the video i probably going to do it at night because that's when i'm kind of creative so i'm going to keep it at night and that's it uh, in the evening i'm going to probably uh, okay i have a task here which i'm going to change it to i'm sorry uh, today i am going to I probably this is okay i'm going to edit my exam video probably in the evening right so i'm just going to give you an example so how you look like so you know what is it about so so i can so as you can see here the days are now broken into morning evening and night uh in my mind i know how long i will have in morning evening and night so i will allocate a task according to the duration or hour of the task will take matching against the label that i have here within morning evening and night now this comes in handy because to do is recently announced sorting by custom sorting so what is custom sorting right so if you click on custom sorting you are now able to sort group by by a variety variety of options here so if i can group by due date default date added but i'll choose label and i'll sort it by priority uh, ascending and okay that's fine so i'll just click it so so this this new feature by today is really helpful for me and it, it matches my my methodology of how to do productivity here or, or my or my own productivity so i have morning evening and night and i if i have more than two tasks in that particular section what i'll do is i will then uh prioritize meaning that the red one comes up first and the yellow or the blue flag will then uh follow according to the priority so the red is always the first priority p1 um, so that, that that that's how i basically manage my tasks so each time i go into the morning or just before at night before the next day i will try to look and see what are the tasks that i have and what can i do according to the indi the, the individual slots like morning evening and night so that's basically how i think i cracked it and i like the system i've been using it for a while right now and it seems to work I mean, yes it's not perfect because there's also a lot of uh, tasks that i get postponed especially when i don't look at it or tasks gets due um, but then again if i were to come in the monday morning and i said i look at my calendar in the morning and say okay what i need to do today okay this is the, my task in my inbox or, okay i know i have tons of meetings i'm not able to achieve this i can move it around under the upcoming tab here so i can just move things around here whether it's today or tomorrow i can just shift it around so that i, I think this this tool is absolutely good and but you need to couple it with uh, a certain methodology of productivity and you need to actually utilize and believe in the system and use the system to make it work so that is my productivity tip and a bit of review of to do is it's a fantastic tool uh, that's about it and see you guys soon and if you find this video helpful please make sure you like this video and don't forget to subscribe for more videos such as this goodbye